Hi everyone, I'm Tony from SUS.com. We are from Washington DC area US. So a year ago, more than a year ago, I introduced the VWire Boson Fix Mount to integrate quickly and conveniently the thermal camera Flip Boson on the DJI Mavic Pro. And later on, without any modification, we uh, move it to the uh, Mavic 2. Um, so you can quickly, you know, convert a regular drone into a thermal drone uh, easily. So, um, it's uh, more than a year and people have loved the idea and uh, we have a lot of customers. Uh, so time for an upgrade to this because there are new features that are requested. So I am very pleased to announce today the VOIR Boson 2.0. So with the new added features, it remains the small form factor lightweight as the VOIR Boson number one. However, it has a lot more features, like seven features added to this. So, uh, first of all, it's so, uh, you know, mountable on the Mavic 1 or the Mavic 2 or a similar drone like Phantom 4. Alright, so uh, fast forward, we have today an Altel Evo drone, a drone that is similar to a Mavic, and we gave it a test. It works great. So the uh, added features are a controller. First of all, that's number one, is controller on the ground where you can control a lot of things. Feature number two is you can tilt the angle remotely uh, using this wheel. Number three is you can change the color palette by using this wheel as well. Number four is you can trigger the remote recording using the controller. Number five is FFC. You can trigger the uh, manual FFC. Number six is that you can change the zoom of the camera remotely as well. And then feature number seven is you can change the game mode. From low, high, manual, etc, etc. Then feature number eight is you have on-screen display. Uh, you can see that it tells you in whatever mode you are in this controller right here it's just a quick small piece you can plug right into the power plug of the monitor you don't have to worry about supply power to this and you can just quickly attach it to it will feel much more in control of everything uh, so now you don't have to worry about the angle you adjust pre-flight is a little too much down or too much forward you can change that on the fly using this wheel. And then you don't have to remember to hit this button on the air unit. To record a video before flight, you can hit this button while the drone is in the air. And then you can change the color palettes, the much needed features of this. You know, you don't want to fly only within the white hot, uh, black hot. You want to change the other things to see things better, you know, by cycling through 10 of the color palettes on the flip boson, you can maybe pick up details better and then you can see that there is an instructional screen it reminds you which button which wheel how many clicks does what when you are done you can hide it okay so that's about the viewer boson 2.0 in fact after we released the viewer boson 1.0 fixed mount with manually adjustable angle before flight we already released the 3-axis gimbal with touchscreen controller for a boson to sit on top of Mavic or underneath a Phantom or um, Inspire, etc, etc. That already added features like changing color palette uh, intuitively on the screen and change the game mode, trigger FFC, trigger the DVR recording, etc, etc. This is something in between. Uh, you don't have that smooth stabilization but you have you can control the tilt angle remotely and you have most of the features of the three axis gimbal system while we want to keep this under a thousand dollars not including the camera um, so everything controller and this including the thermal monitor as well here you can control the, uh, the tilt uh, no, they're changing color palettes, and then I can reset, okay, 
I can uh, fill it now. Up or down, like that. You feel much more in control. And then, now you can also zoom in and out, right? Or you can do, uh, change the game mode. Alright. Right. Low gain, high gain, uh, auto gain, uh, etc. And then you can do FFC trigger from this button right here. And then you can also uh, record, trigger recording or stop recording using this button uh, as well. Okay, I just did. Uh, now again. Alright, recording again. So this controller sits right here on the side of the monitor very neatly and then uh, very uh, discreet. We don't need to worry too about it too much. Let me fly it far away. Alright, get some footage of this. So if you are interested in this, if you have drones or you don't have drones, that's fine. If you don't have the drone, contact us. We also sell the, dro the drones as well. Uh, and if you're interested in this or you already have the VR Boson version 1, please contact us. We'll be more than happy to work with you to find out the best uh, package for you. Uh, so if you like a little brick, uh, a little discount on this product, uh, yes, we can do so. Uh, uh, if you are willing to provide us with your footage, your thermal footage or thermal pictures that help us spread, you know, spread the word out, or you are willing to post uh, some links to forums, Facebook, uh, Google, review, that would be great. So thank you for watching our, our channel, and if you do like the idea in general, please give us a thumbs up, and do subscribe to our channel, hit that bell button, so next time we have a video you will be notified, either informational or just uh, new products, or instruction, etc, etc, uh, then you will be notified. Uh, again, thank you very much for watching, and have a to everyone.